What's up you guys, it's been Sanity, and today we're gonna learn one of the most common moves in breaking called the coffee grinder. You've probably seen your friend do this, you've seen this on TV, you've seen this in movies, and today, you are gonna do it. Before we get started, if anyone is interested in joining one of my weekly online breaking classes, you could click the link below and join my beginner or intermediate class, okay? Let's get started. Now the first thing you're gonna need if you're practicing in your house without shoes is socks. They don't have to match, but you just need them. Second thing you need is some space. Clear out some furniture and give yourself some space. This move has two basic parts. And the first is the hop, okay? We're gonna get into a squatting position and we're gonna place our hands right in front of us like we're like a little bunny rabbit and we're gonna lean forward onto our hands and then we're gonna go back and then we're gonna go forward and then we're gonna go back and we're gonna lift up our hands forward and back, forward and back, forward and back. Now this time when we lean forward, we're gonna jump just this high. Don't kick your legs up in the air, just this high. Ready, we lean forward, our legs go jump. And notice my hand stayed on the ground. Then I lift it up, and then I go jump, up, jump, up, jump, up, jump, up, jump, up. Step two is our leg, right? Our leg is gonna spin in a circle around us as we hop, right? Sounds complicated, but let's break it down. From this position, put your leg out, and you're gonna swing it forward, and what you're gonna notice is it's gonna get stuck right about here, okay? So you're gonna have to lift up your hand, keep it sliding, lift up this hand, and you're just gonna hook your leg right here. From here, we're gonna place our hands in front. Okay, let's repeat that process. Ready, it goes. Swing, lift up your hand, lift up your other hand, boom. One more time. Swing down, okay? This time, lift up both hands. Ready, swing down. Step three is the jump, okay? We're gonna lean forward and we're gonna jump, okay? Ready, we lean forward and we do that jump that we practiced in the beginning. Ready, four, jump. One more time, jump. And this time when we jump, we're gonna shoot our leg back and out, right back to where we start, okay? All together, it goes swing, hook, jump, out. Okay, one more time, slow motion, swing, hook, jump, swing it back, and out, okay? All together, swing, hook, jump. Once you get comfortable with this step, the next is to eliminate one of the stops. Right now, we are going stop, 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 right? We wanna eliminate one of these stops, and the easiest one to eliminate is this one. So this time, we're gonna swing our leg in a complete circle and stop right here, right where we start. Okay, let's try it, ready? Swing, boom, to here, okay? And we basically wanna figure out that timing, okay? As our leg swings, our hands go down. As our hands go down, we jump, we land back here. Again, swing, jump. Now the next step is to eliminate this stop, okay? And that's when we're gonna be able to do a continuous motion, a continuous coffee grinder. So let's go for two. It's okay to drag your legs. That's why we got the socks, so you don't burn your feet. Swing your leg two times around, stop here. Okay, here we go, ready? It goes one, two, stop. Eventually, try to go for three. One, two, three. Now, once you get comfortable with this continuous motion, once you can do like five, the next two parts are just making your coffee grinder look pretty. The first part is to keep your legs straight, right? When your leg bends and you know it doesn't look as nice as if when your leg is completely straight, right? So we wanna keep our legs straight. The easiest way to do that, either pull your toes back or point your toes, either one, will help actively remind you to keep your legs straight. Second part is the harder one, is we wanna hover our foot off the ground, right? It doesn't have to be way up here, but just don't drag it anymore, right? Imagine if you have shoes, your foot on the ground is gonna go all the way around, right? 
and it might even get stuck. So hover your foot off the ground, swinging it around and keeping it straight, okay? Let's try three. Ready? We go swing, jump, swing, jump, swing, jump, swing, jump. And there you have it. You have successfully learned the coffee grinder. Now, in order to get good at this, it's up to you to get out there and practice. If you guys want to learn more about breaking, you guys can join one of my weekly online breaking classes. I have a beginner class, an intermediate class, and a monthly master class. All right, hope you're doing well, and I'll see you soon. Peace.